Okay, so this is Hampshire again. I want to try out what the stunt mode was, so we're gonna do a little bit gameplay of this. Like I said, this game is crazy. Oh, alright, so it's like a top down perspective. This game is crazy. I recommend buying it if it's cheap. I don't know how much it is though. But it's like one of those crazy games. So that was the, that was the mission. One of those crazy games. Crazy indie games. And it, by the looks of it, it's, on, it's got like hundreds of, not hundreds of levels, but you know, loads of levels. Kind of like, it seems like a game you wouldn't stop playing. Oh. Whoa! It's the next level. I like it. it's kind of top downy. It's kind of different. I kind of like it like this. And it's got crazy. You can kind of admire it from a different perspective. Well, it looks like you can't actually drop down from a high height, otherwise you die. It's supposed to be stump mode, but I don't really see the stunts. Oh dear. Like, where is the stunt gameplay? Secret found. Secrets in the level. I'm going slow now as I hit the tar. Takes a bit of a while for it to go. Whoa! Down there. I like the level design, it's cool. The objects in the environments. So what's so stunt about this? I mean, it's a different game mode because it's from the top, which I like. But what's so stunt about it? Well. God. There are a few different ways to go by the looks of it. You can't drop off a high ledge in this mode. Why should you die? You can't even drop off a ledge that high because you just die. I guess that's different about it. A windmill. It's funny. Remember there's an actual break button. Oh god. Death pit. Go. This is sucked up by like a vacuum. This kind of looks like, like, that freaking, that new Willy Wonka movie that came out, well, a new Willy Wonka movie, that one that came out, like, eight years ago now, but you know what I mean. That's what it looks like. This level does. Okay, oh, I see. <laughs> That's cool. Oh, it died instantly. Turbo hamster. Oh, God. There we go. Again, turbo hamster. I'm like stuck. Oh, what happened? Oh. 
want to land on it. I'm gonna try and land on it quickly and see what it does. Oh god. Turbo hamster. Oh, I want to land on it. Let me land on it. No. No. I have no idea what it does. I landed on it and nothing happened. Utterly disappointed. Oh, this is cool. It's a night timey. Oh, night timey. Neon y. Oh, this looks cool. I'm a sucker for stuff like this. This type of lighting. I'm not used to the fact that you die from like falling off. Ooh. Does anyone hear that farting? It's like a. like that noise in the freaking background of the game. It's disgusting. Oh no! No! Let's restart. This top down, this actual top down perspective actually makes it a bit difficult because you know it's kind of a you know if the game was entirely like this you probably get used to it but the main campaign is from behind the camera which is weird. It's weird that they would have a different game mode that has a completely different camera angle, but it's cool. Kind of, kind of reminds me of those like old. I don't know actually. Hmm. Oh, of course. Make it go dark. Ah. Oh, <laughs> let's go try and Let me do that. Oh no, I didn't know that would happen. Not again, no, oh, gonna redo it again. Oh wow. Well it looks like it's a lot more difficult to stunt mode. Maybe I don't like about it, I kinda wish there was like a proper break mode. Like a proper break button to break. Oh no. God damn it. No! Oh dear. Go, go, go! Did it. So, yeah, so by the looks of it, stunt mode is a lot more difficult. A little bright, colourful. I wonder, no. I was wondering if you could, like. Oh, this is weird. Confusing. Where do I go? Up. What? This is weird. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. This is weird. So you can, like, change perspectives and go up the wall. That's very weird. Alright, let's just try that again. So the game actually adds quite a lot of new ideas into the mix. Hmm. 
Right, let's try this again. So it's kind of like a magnet and it puts you on a different... Kind of like Super Mario Galaxy a bit. Oh wow, it's a bit weird. Where am I going now? Oh no! The controls are like a bit reversed. It's kind of confusing. Well, wow. So, by the looks of it, stunt mode, stunt mode is definitely a lot harder compared to the normal mode. mode. Normal campaign mode. I mean, it's not the fact that it's hard, it's the fact that you don't know what, you know, coming, you got to learn the level a lot more in stunt mode. God damn it. I really wish they wouldn't, why, I don't know why they made I guess there will be a cut there. I have to do something. Let's try, oh wow, let's try and beat this level and then call it the video again, but it looks like I'm not going to do it this time either. This vid, this level is extremely difficult. Especially if you screw up like that instantly. But nice that there was like an instant retry, like in uh, Trials Evolution, because you need it in these type of games. Oh, that's not fair, that's bullshit. I really don't like in this mode that you... That you, um... Die from falling a height, because you don't do it in a normal campaign. And then, all of a sudden, in this mode, you die from falling a height. It's very stupid. I don't think I like this mode now. God damn it. Sometimes, like, from this perspective, it's actually quite a lot harder because you've got to learn the camera again. You know, the camera can kind of screw you a bit. Well, I'm not going to do it this time either. Well, alright, so we'll leave it there. I obviously can't beat this level. I'm not a too big fan of this level, this stunt, this, this game mode, because it, you die from falling in a, like, the, the tiniest height, and you don't in the normal campaign. And by the looks of it, there's only, there's only, like, one more level after that, so, yeah. Stunt mode, you know, it's fun, it's cool, because it's from a different perspective, but I'm not a big fan of it, because you die from you know, the slightest height, so yeah.